Pugsy sticking with the Sidra pick. It's a Drew on the Olgrim. Yeah, these are good. These are good picks overall. Looks like Pierre's been playing a lot of Taros, huh? Um, yeah, I, I know him. A... I know him as a Thatch main. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, the the, the Taros pick has been pretty predominant uh, lately. And then Wingshell. I feel like I don't know if I've ever seen Wingshell play a character that's not Val. Start of the match, pretty even across the board. No breakout leads. All right, sorry about that, folks. We're back in this. Here we go. Wing Shell and Pierre going up against Istadru and Pugsy. Istadru's rocking the Ulgrim. Uh, I interesting to see him still going with that. I figured he'd be playing Bryn, you know? Lance got a few nerfs. Istradru's still out here with his Ulgrim. Um, and Pugsy, I don't know that Pugsy's all that familiar oh. with fighting with a Lance on his team, which is pretty unique. It's difficult to do if, you, if you're oh, not used no. to it. It can be really difficult. Pugsy might go down early yes. here. Wingshell with a perfect down air to finish him off. Oh, man. Okay, early lead for Wingshell and Pierre in the first game of the set. But only a slight lead. There we go, Istadru. Also down and Wingshell soon to follow. All right, Pierre last on the field with three stocks. Rocking that Taros pick. Throws that hammer away, now left unarmed. His partner coming back, grabbing the sword. All right, Pierre off in the edge. Wingshell, oh, nice there, covering his buddy to get up to the top of the stage. But Isidru with the knockoff yet again. Pierre still rocking three stocks. He's oh, looking good. Yeah, well, you say uh, that. Oh, well, right? that's, my bad. that's uh, my yeah, bad. That's that my bad. That is your fault. bad, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry about that, everybody. All right. Wait. Oh, nice. Okay. They almost turned that into a 2v1, which would have been sick. But at least his partner got him out of that trouble there. Uh, Wingshell getting deep in or into red now. His weapon gets disarmed. He just waits that up. Oh, no. Ooh. Okay, Pugsy there. Pugsy saving the day. This dude was about to get caught in a nasty 2v1 combo. But Pugsy... Ever so vigilant, taking care of his teammate, handling the opponents. He's a jack of all trades. Oh, wow. okay. Well, okay, it's the Drew. He did a good job. <laughs> That's you close. Know, you can I freak out. I was worried there, bro. Yeah, you can freak out and bonk there very easily. All right, Double there we kill. go. Okay, you know what, Pugsy? The ace. They're back in this. <laughs> Two socks up in the, in the game. Started a little bit behind, but they've, they've turned it around. Hopefully they can push this lead here a little bit because Pierre and Wingshell, despite how it looks, they're really not far behind. They could... They could immediately equalize. There's one. Okay, they got the Pugsy might be Pugsy. soon to follow. Pierce going for it. Pugsy fighting way oh! off the side. It doesn't matter. Pierce got it. Oh, that was an And they equalized. Oh, such a good play by Pierre off on the edge. All right, trying to get some 2v1 damage on an Isidre before Pugsy arms up. And now everybody's back into the fray here. Oh, what? He oh, slid that. That was so slid. slick. He saw the slide oh, in that. I like that. That was a clean play from Pierre, but not enough to steal that stock. Everybody still has one life left in this game. Oh, it's coming down to the wire here. You, you, you know, even though it's a best of five, you, you got to show up every match. It's you want to get an early it's win. Not, yeah, you got to get an early lead here. Okay, Pugsy. Oh, there goes Pierre. Oh, despite, I feel like Pugsy and Isidru were, were fighting from behind most of this time. And uh, they, but they brought it back here, and I don't know if Wing Shell can handle the heat. That's oh, it. Is yeah, Drew cleaning it. up? He said the solidarity taught. Oh man. Pugsy right. and Isidru take game one in the set. But it wasn't. They had to fight for that a little bit. I see. It Pugsy. wasn't. It wasn't too easy for them to gain. No, right. and like I said, Wing Shell and Pierre. I mean, I think as a team, they're so strong. You know, if it if it ends up being that two v one versus either Pugsy or Isidru at the end, you know, they've got a lot of those flashy team combos to finish it off. So I wouldn't be comfortable in that two v one. So you got to kind of maintain a little bit of a lead here if you want to keep the one up on them. All right, no character swaps coming in from any of our players. Everybody sticking with their guns. I like that. I like that. <laughs> oh yeah, Pierre with the N Sig is his clan. That's good, dude. He's got the character for it. See, that's why you know he can't pick anyone but Taros. He's got to, <laughs> you know, rep that end. Dude, I know Pierre as a Thatch main, man. He's playing this Taros, and I get it. I get it. Believe me, I get it. 
Yeah, but, but what about Thatch, though? But what if Thatch what doesn't have an end sig that makes uh, a million memes spawn on Reddit, so. <laughs> well, but he has the down sig that makes a million memes yeah, spawn. Well, well, that's true. He's got to join a new clan if he wants to make that switch. All right, Pugsy, the most damaged of everybody in this one. We usually see Pugsy holding on to his stock longer yeah. than everybody. Um, but it's just damage, you know? It's not the stock. He, he, he can take damage, but he's not going to lose the stock that quick. I know. I was thinking, I was actually, because we're used to seeing... Uh -oh. oh, oh, no! no! Wigshaw was oh. so expecting that gravity cancel anchor. Oh, gosh, yeah. He bet it all on that anchor. <laughs> For some reason, it's well, it's 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 an attractive option because you hit the wall with because it. I do you, that oh anger. no! It's oh no! It's oh true. no! Bonking his head. Okay. Jeez. Honestly, I was gonna say this, and it's too late to say it, but I was gonna say I think Wingshell and Pierre turn it around and take game two. <laughs> well, now it seems obvious. Well, no. Well, it's over. <laughs> hey, it was early on. I believe but. you. I believe you were you were you were into Pierre and Wingshell before it was cool. I get it. Yeah, I was. <laughs> Why do you think they're a type of team that can make adjustments? And maybe they have right here. Okay. <laughs> Wingshell off on the edge. Nice fade away from the wall to get right away from that ground pound. But, oh, but the double hit taking both blue team off the side of the stage. Isidru was going down there, confirmed that KO, but not able to get it. No weapon in hand. He decides to back off. Wing shell. Oh, can he hang on? Yes, still but alive. Just He's got the gauntlet siders oh, yeah. to help him back. He's not even under any pressure. Now he gets the reset. Is he gonna do any damage with this extra He's life? He's already been got giving? It. Well, yeah, a little bit. He did some. Yeah, he, he did, did some. some. It wasn't nothing. All right, the two v one advantage. <laughs> oh, nice. Neutral there. Oh, Pierre's air. gotta be careful. He's so far outside. He's got nothing left, and he luckily makes it back. Pugsy was so close to finishing off that stock. Now Pugsy's knocked off without a weapon. Pierre might just turn around and aim. Oh, oh what? Oh. That was on his own okay. teammate. You gotta watch out, dude. With two a when you're wielding two axes, <laughs> yeah, dude. You may have to cool it a little bit, Isidro, on Ooh. the double axe. Game. So Pugsy is the uh, has the least amount of stocks on the field now, which is unusual. Because every match we've been seeing from Pugsy today, yeah. he's the stock tank. Not only that, but he's also the damage oh, lead. Oh, but now he's taking <laughs> stocks. <laughs> Wing shell going down. Pierre. There we go. On the other side, quick to follow. All right, now they have the stock lead again. You know, similar to the first game, they trailed behind for the longest time, but then when it came down to it, they had what it takes. Okay, I like that. Ignore the other guy. Get that 2v1 combo going. Okay, they've actually been playing their last stocks here pretty immaculately. Red team has really turned it around, doing lots of damage. Isidru was looking for that weapon throw. Now it's a swap out for the axe. Pugsy with another edge guard opportunity on Pierre on the side. Isidru looking for his way back. Oh, I like the way Pugsy rotates over there. Save his teammate. Keep him in play. Both Wingshell and Pierre so heavily okay. damaged, but Pierre... There's a chance that Pierre and Wingshell bring this back, but I gotta say, it's a pretty slim chance. Pierre gets disarmed way off the side. Wingshell trying to help relieve the pressure, and Pierre, well, he's Ooh. able to make it back in some way or another. They are in trouble. Wingshell and Pierre on their final breaths oh. here. There goes Wingshell. It's just Pierre left. It'd be a miracle oh. for him to... What is he doing? He's got, he's <laughs> got to tempt that chainsaw. Oh, oh man. That's it. <laughs> Dang, you know, I love that Isidru play there on the corner, both sides of the field, keeping it down with the chainsaw. Because you make them, you know? Yeah. You force them to do something. That, that puts Pugsy and Isidru up by two now. Pierre and Wingshell, they've really been keeping up well. In, in any of these games, it looks like they could have taken it. But, you know, it plays out and who ends up winning, right? This would be great to see. Uh, I, I would like to see, I don't know. Like I said, like we said at the top of this, I want to see Pugsy find his like partner, you know? Somebody can put that promise ring on and <laughs> take him to BCX, you know what I mean? Like, Dude, it might be Isidru. Because Pugsy has been such an amazing player. Like the end of last season he, we saw he his return. He deserves a solid teammate. Someone yeah. that's there for him when he really needs it. And Isidru really has played with all the best. Like he's, he's, <laughs> he's got so much experience playing with such good players. That's true. All right, let's see how this third match, this third game shapes up here. Oh, he got the oh. reset. Okay, okay, that could have been worse for Pierre. Honestly, he yeah, he, he got, got out of there. You got, like, you got a, a sidelight reset on you against Cannon. You, oh. Usually, you just count that stock okay. out. Okay, is he gonna get the big oh. double turnaround? He can yes. still make it. Pugsy can still make oh, it. Oh no! Wow, what a crazy trade off at the bottom. Wait, Isidru still in trouble. Wing shell. All right, gonna let him. Oh, wow, he let him a little bit too much leash there. Able to make it over the top high, but now off to the other side of the stage. Unarmed Pugsy. There to, oh yes, there to pick up a KO, maybe Wingshell fighting his way up through the sword slashes. Pugsy's got one for each side, Pierre. Okay. Oh my gosh. Close, close for Wingshell, still holding on to all three of his stocks. He's not even in red yet. Wingshell's looking good. 
looking healthy. That is true. And Val, Val's got some defense. She's low on Yeah, he could survive right? a couple hits here, not too many more. He's getting all this damage out, though. Do you think they, they should focus down Wing Shell or change their plan at all? Okay, Pierre, oh. though. Oh, oh, dirty! You know what? Oh Actually, my never goodness, mind. Pierre, you think you can just ground pound Pugsley off the side yeah, like that? I Such would. a long telegraph <laughs> meteor strike. Of Whoa, course, wait, Pugsley. Wait, okay, but well, Wingshell, you know Wingshell claps back immediately. Yeah. Your description was too long and you got ground pounded. <laughs> <laughs> Wingshell exactly still has all three of his stocks. He's I killing it right it. now. Oh, that'll do okay, it. Okay, well, yeah, that's fair. Hot. Pierre's got to be careful because, yeah, the plan for Isidru and Pugsy is definitely take out Pierre immediately. You would they think, take yeah. out Pierre, the game could be theirs. And Pierre, I would... Pierre probably has to play differently now as a result, too. He's got to be more evasive. I mean, just don't don't be the center of any attention right now because he's in red while Wingshell still has is yeah. healthy with two stocks left. Isidru coming up. Whoa, wow, what, Wingshell. dude? Whoa, no. no. Double oh. dare, dude. He double dared him. Dude, Wingshell really risked it for the biscuit there, and it was Ooh. not worth it. Yeah. Isidru, what a great punish. Oh, Pierre, this is crazy. Actually, it's genius. Good good move there going underneath because Wingshell's on the other side to defend. Oh, Wingshell okay. scores a KO on Isidru. They might Ooh. be able to take Gosh. out Pugsy. They got to take out. It's a race now. Yeah, yeah. It, either Pugsy or Pierre is going to go down first. Who's it going to be? Oh, Pierre in trouble uh -oh. at the top. Uh -oh. And oh, uh -oh. Pugsy, Pugsy knocked Pugsy him too. as well. <laughs> They're chasing him down so hard. Okay, this is it for Wingshell and Pierre in this set. If they can't oh. turn around in this game on this final stock. Uh-oh, uh -oh. Uh -oh. Pugsy versus Pierre off the side. Pugsy wins. Can Wingshell finish off finish off this 2v1? Okay, I want to see some crazy 2v1 He's got to do it. If Wingshell loses this, they are out of the tournament. Wingshell has to clutch this out right now. And it would be it'd be so insane for him to do it. But if he can oh. somehow just take out Pugsy, oh, he's got to... Oh, no! Yes, dude. Excellent play Ooh. from Isidru. Cleaning up that stock and taking the set. A swift 3-0. Who showing this new team has got the stuff. Okay, I'm liking what I'm seeing from these guys. Pugsy and Isidru. They are go. looking good. They are looking good. They're going to move up in the bracket, and they'll be going up against Lil Cap and Ithro oh. next. You can see it right, right down there. So, Pugsy and Isidru are going to be going up against Lil Cap and Ithro. I got to say, that's a pretty difficult matchup. That's That could be the end of the line for Pugsy.